Welcome to the week ahead. Headlines. Sri Lanka shares China Exim Bank agreement with Paris Club. New electricity bill to cabinet. Another policy rate cut likely. Sri Lanka's external debt negotiations will gain renewed interest this week as Sri Lanka shared its agreement with China Exim Bank with the Paris Club creditors. Central Bank Governor Nandalal Wirasinghe, speaking to Bloomsburg, said he hopes the official creditors' committee, led by Japan, India and the Paris Club of Nations, will now propose an agreement to restructure Sri Lanka's debt. He added that he expects that this will allow the IMF to approve the second fund facility tranche of $330 million by the end of the year. According to Energy Minister Kanchan Vijayasekara, on Monday, a revised draft bill to reform Sri Lanka's power sector will be presented to the cabinet. The restructure involves unbundling the country's state-run Ceylon Electricity Board into separate distribution, generation and transmission sections, and then to bring in private investment. On Thursday, the Monetary Board of the Central Bank will meet to determine policy interest rates. Another rate cut is very likely due to disinflation since September last year. In October 2023, Colombo-centric inflation increased slightly to 1.5%, while food prices fell 5.2%. Since June, policy rates have been cut by 550 basis points, and a tepid credit growth may also tempt the regulator to cut rates further.